This is Discover Hawkington, the original HCAM series where we bring our cameras out to the events and activities happening in our community. We hope you enjoy this episode, check out more entries in the series, and keep us informed about other Hawkington happenings as we discover Hawkington. So we're here today making no-sew blankets for the dogs at Bay Path. It's a project that was started uh, quite a few years ago before I was even part of this group, but um, we're here on behalf of the Small Hands Big Hearts group as part of the Hopkinton Moms group. Um, in general, just the goal of our group is to get kids and families involved in community service activities and giving back to the community, um, just teaching little ones uh, the joy of giving back and acts of kindness. Um, and we're happy to be here today at the library making the no-sew blankets for the dogs. Uh, when we're all set after today, we'll carry them over to Bay Path and just present them over there. And they're usually pretty happy to get them. I joined the moms group um, just to be part of the community, get to know other moms in town. Um, and then I joined Small Hands Big Hearts in particular just because I've always enjoyed community service and wanted to be able to give back to the community. Um, and I wanted to be able to teach that to my kids. Uh, if you're not in the moms group, you can join the moms group. There's a small yearly dues fee um, that's usually due in June. So you can join now. I believe you can go online and Google us, we'll come up. <laughs> Dogs are like humans, except they just look different. So if you want to be warm at night, then the dog should be warm at night. He's like a small Yorkie that plays fetch a lot and has a lot of energy and just runs around and plays. One of my kitties is named Charlie, and that's a boy. And then one of my kitties is named Chloe. And then she's a girl, and they do like almost everything together, and we just decided on the names last night, even though we've had them last, uh, we, we got them last weekend. I'm her twin, and I also have two cats, and so they, they're pretty shy, and they kind of stay under the bed, so we... We try to get them out sometimes, but but like they only really come out to feed them. And recently they just started like uh, being able to pet, and now we can like play with them and stuff. And they're we only got them like a few days ago on Saturday, and they mostly eat like uh, wet food and like dry food and stuff. Um, the Moms Group is a great way to make friends in town for yourself and also for your children. Um, it's great for moms who work to meet people, like at Moms Night Out, um, at family events. It's also great for stay-at-home parents who may be struggling and looking for ways to connect with other families. Um, it's also a good way to give back to the community because we also do a lot of charitable donations and activities.